going on with that thing? All other armors look like rusted buckets of scrap. You really think you can do that? Karuf, come on! You know me. If it isn't the savior of Meridian, and of my very own operation. Larand, say hello. Hello, nice to meet you. You know, if it weren't for this one, I probably wouldn't be standing here right now. I was at Baron Light when the Tanakh attacked. Nasty business. But every codger in Osaram is thankful you drove him off. So what are you doing out here? Well, to hammer it plain, there's treasure in the West. Unclaimed scrap and ancient metal. And I've got a sturdy band of salvagers that's ready to take advantage. We'll buy any scrap you got. And if you're looking for machine parts, we've got the best in the West. Guaranteed. And soon we'll be trading in more than just that. For too long, the West has been, well, forbidden. Dangerous. But what if I told you we could make an armor so tough, so infallible, that you'd never have to worry about survival out here again? I'd be curious to take a look at it. Of course you would. <laughs> And that's why I've asked my most talented salvagers to find what they need to make that armor. Each of them will present their work to me. The best protection will go on sale to hunters, just like you. Lucky me. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have some business to attend to back in Chainscrape. Larand can take care of you while I'm gone. Can't wait to see what you come up with, my boy. Leave it to me. It'll blow all the others out of the forge. You have got to help me. What are you talking about? The armor. I made a dozen versions of it. But none of them were good enough. And there are other crews further west. If they make better armor than mine, I can kiss that keg full of shards goodbye. So you get a prize if Karif picks your armor? A big one. And I finally have the perfect design. I just need the right parts, and fast. So maybe you'd be willing to pick up a contract and get them for me? What would I be looking for? Shell walker containers. Their plating's made to withstand a lot of damage. It'll make the perfect armor. I know it. I think I can handle that. Ah, oh, thank the forge. All right. We scouted out a herd near here. Here's the contract. It'll tell you everything you need to know. You take the machines down. My people will pick up the containers. I'll give this a closer look later. Thanks. Counting on you, Aloy. before going on the hunt. There's a lot of ancient wrecks out here. Must have been a huge battle. Ah, he's good! If it isn't the hero of the day. Sure I'm glad you came by when you did. Are you all Delvers? We've been working No Man's Land for a while. I was hoping to get back to Baron Light by the time they opened the gates, you know? After that embassy of theirs. 
Seeing as how we almost got minced to pieces just now, I'm guessing things didn't go so well. You could say that. It's not like No Man's Land was safe to begin with. But I didn't think I'd have to worry about the Sanak, the neutral territory. And now, they're riding machines! If you were headed back to Baron Light, why did you stop here? We ran across some ruins nearby. Thought we'd take a gander, find some good salvage. But the place is full of weird red crystals. Can't get through the stuff. So we ended up making camp here. First thing tomorrow, though, we head straight to Baron Light. Should probably send a message to our crew down at Jagged Deep about all this, too. Jagged Deep? It's a dig site by this big lake down south. Old world scrap everywhere. Can't miss it. <laughs> and that's my cue. Here. Thanks for helping us out. Maybe I'll get into more trouble and see you around. Oh, well, let's hope not. I'm sure that's the passage Larian's contract mentioned. I should make sure I have my facts straight. Give the contract a quick read. Showwalkers use this passage regularly, and Larian wants their plating. I just need to wait them out at his camp. Might be a good idea to place some traps on the road first. Catch the convoy by surprise. Looks like the coordinates Silence gave me match that wreckage. Did he install Hades on the other time? of the coordinates I scanned from the spire. A workshop underneath a dead forest titan. Just the kind of place Silence would slink away to. But what was he doing here?
some kind of log. Most of it's redacted. It looks like Silence put a lot of work into forcing Hades to talk. Poor Hades. So cramped in there. No room to think. You can't even speak. The device is blocking. Now the processing warp of a Titan on the other hand. Check it out. Well, you're used to that. But once I load you on that, you'll be so much more comfortable. Until until. Aloy. Consider this message a beacon to help guide you out of the fog of ignorance. Using explosives, I've detached the processing orb from the Titan overhead, a perfect cage for our mutual friend, Hades, in order to render it cooperative. Tell her what we discussed about the mysterious signal that gave you life. <laughs> you need a reminder that you have failed. So you see, Eloy, Gaia can be safely rebooted. As for where to find a backup, well, you'll need to trot along after me to find out. He thinks he's got it all figured out. Bastard. And I guess there's only one way to find out where he moved the orb. Here I am, following along after silence like a fool. After he tricked me by rigging his lance to steal Hades. Crazy AI that wants to kill everything. Can just let me do the same thing and destroy it? And now I'm gonna have to put up with more of his self-righteous bull. I shouldn't use frost on it. a pack of scrappers to close up any salvage.
Highlands must be pretty confident he's found a backup of Gaia, but how? Every place I've checked, every lead, they've all been dead ends. All backups purged. So what did Hades tell him? My focus oh there! Is some kind of What's Honora doing this far west? Ah, uh, no matter, no matter. I can get you stocked up for the wild. goes into the hillside. Ruin. Okay. Let's see where this goes. I guess Silence used that machine to haul his prize. That must be the orb Silence stuck Hades in. And the door. Looks like a pharaoh facility. Or a zero dawn? Enough. It's time to finish this. Does Aloy still think she can restore Gaia? Save life on Earth? Yeah, Aloy does. What do you know, Hades? Twice you tried to destroy life on Earth, and twice you failed. The only extinction you ever brought about is your own. And there's no tricked-out plans to save you this time. 
You remember this? Yes, data intact. Known viable biospheres aborted in years 2542161268. So? That, that's centuries ago. It's what you were designed to do. There won't need to be. I'm saving this one! Master Override, arms. To activate, state name and rank. Elizabeth Sobek, Alpha Prime. Master Override activated. Bridging extinction protocol. see you've dealt with Hades. Yeah. Think maybe you can stay dead this time? It will. You can trust. Trust? Yes. Trust. As in, since I did what you could never do, and extracted all of Hades' priceless knowledge, you can trust that I was willing to actually let you destroy it this time. So back to holograms instead of face-to-face? -face? What, afraid I'd stab you or something? There's a reason I'm I... I'm using the same spyware, I see. So, all those times I called, you could have just answered. But I guess you just prefer to go on spying all this time. My world stopped revolving around you months ago, Aloy. I've had work to do. Countless hours of research. As demanding and time-intensive as it has been critical to the fate of this planet. <laughs> right. Of course. You're just trying to save the world, too. That's right. The difference, of course, is that unlike you, I've produced the results. Did you find a backup of Gaia or not? Oh, yes. I believe I did. Where? Voila. Why do you think I summoned you here? Behind that gene-locked hatch lie the ruins of the ancient facility where the Hades Extinction Protocol was perfected. A testing process that ran hundreds of trials, each of them using a backup of Gaia. Hades told you this? It took some convincing. But yes. So, are you ready to go get what you've been searching for for the last six months? Or are you just going to stand there with your mouth open? You mentioned you've been busy. Exceptionally busy. But not so busy you couldn't teach Tanakh the rebels to override machines, ride them as mounts? Aloy, the only issue you should be concerned about is obtaining a Gaia backup. Perhaps if you focused more, you might actually see results. That's not exactly a denial, Silence. Take it any way you want. <sighs> All right. I'll search the facility for a Gaia backup. But just to be clear, Silence, if this ends up being another one of your tricks... It's a gene-locked hatch, Eloy. You're literally the only person who can open it. How could I set a trap inside? Trick me again, Silence, and our next conversation will be face to face. Though you won't have much to say, on account of my spear being buried in your throat. Eloy, thanks to me, everything you desired... Everything you've been fumbling about, unable to achieve for six months, is now within your grasp. Now, I know you didn't learn much about manners growing up a Nora outcast. But in a situation like this, you say, thank you, and I say, you're welcome. Identity scan. Genetic profile confirmed. Entry 
completely messed up obviously but despite the malfunction you can still get through if you'll be patient for a while longer see those crystals there the osram call them fire gleam they're combustible not nearly powerful enough to blast through a door like that but maybe just enough to jolt it open a bit more exactly it will only work with an igniter I'm sending you the schematics now. To build it, you'll need some machine parts and the oil from a kindle weed plant. That only grows underwater, but you should be able to find some at the nearby lake. The parts are more complicated. You'll need a spark coil from within a leap lashes power cell. Remove the power cell before you kill the machine, or else it'll break. Got it. Well, I already have some deep water kindle weed. Just need to get the parts. for the igniter. Now I just need to build this thing. There's a workbench near the entrance to the facility. From your time tinkering with Hades? Tinkering? More like extracting invaluable data. There. Should be able to use this to blow up that fire gleam now. Indeed. A useful combination. It's how I detached the processing orb from the horse in the first place. Great.
I think I'm in. Then by all means, proceed. Bet I could use this igniter if I find more places with fire gleam. Focus on the task at hand, Eloy. <sighs> this whole place is flooded. And there's another gene lock door on the other side. But that's where any guy backups would have been stored. I have to find a way to get over there. Well, this is familiar. Making my way through ancient crumbling ruins while you spy on me through my focus. Stop waxing nostalgic and concentrate on finding a backup. Be a good idea to drop that ladder. Thank <laughs> you. 